myself was not thinking of attending Nityanand Doham in December, but I was telling people, enriching them, even those who didn't have money, that they could manifest the money to attend. And I, I just... So, I, I suddenly realized one morning, I'm telling everybody that if you don't have money, it's not a problem, you can manifest it. And I myself was not considering attending um, Nityanand Doham. And I actually believed it when I was telling people that they can manifest the money. And so I just had a huge click and I realized not only can I manifest the money, I, I should manifest the money. So I simply made the decision that I was going to attend Nityanand Doham in Thailand in December. And from that moment on, I just had no doubt at all that I would be there. I, I didn't look at, oh, I don't have the money or how can I raise the money? Those issues were secondary. And I just knew that all of them would be resolved. But I was very clear that I would be attending Nityanand Doham. And I, obviously, I, it was helped by the fact that I was at IA and the space Swamiji was holding uh, was really supporting me. And that Nityanand Doham was starting on December 9th. And so I, I left, I went back to the U.S. And... And November got over, still I didn't have any money, but again, I never had any doubt. People were asking me, are you going? I said, I would say yes, but they're saying, but when are you paying? And I, I would say, you know, it's, it's happening. So finally, it was December 1st. I, Nityanandom was starting on December 9th. It was December 1st. I still didn't have any money. So this is eight days before the program starts. Uh, again, I, but what was beautiful was I, I never doubted what would happen, that it would happen. So on December 2nd, uh, I, you know, there were some, um, I think it was a dial the avatar call. I had called in on December 1st and Swamiji asked me, what obstacles do you have? And he said, and uh, I said, money is my obstacle. He blessed me. Next day, my mother, uh, I was talking to my mother. She knew that I was trying to go there. I never asked her for the money because uh, I didn't really want to ask her. She said, you know, I just really, I want to like help you with this. So I'm going to, uh, I'll give you about uh, two lakh rupees. That's about $3,000. And so it was a, the fees for Nityanand was $12,000. I needed another $1,500 for travel. So I needed a total of $13,500. And suddenly on December 2nd, one, exactly one week before the program, I, uh, my mother committed to give me about $3,000. And um, so just like that, um, Swamiji had a couple of sessions for, to help people with wealth completion. And, um, I just stayed in that process. And finally on December 7th, I had, um, I still needed 8,500 us dollars. So I had about $5,000 commitment raised and I needed 8,500 and, um, you know, I, um, I had no idea where to go. Um, but what happened is someone ended up connecting her who, um, who agreed to loan me the money. So she didn't even really know me that well. But two days before the event, I had the full amount. I just went and booked my tickets. The next day I flew out and I was in, uh, I was in uh, Thailand for Cape for Nityanand Doham on the day of the program. So that's how I manifested uh, Nityanand Doham. So far, 